And how long have you been doing this kind of I've style? been airbrushing for probably close to 40 years now. 40 years. You said that uh, you're self-taught outside of the workshop. So when did you find out that you were artistic? Um, I actually have a art degree in commercial art. I went to college for that. Um, I've always been interested in airbrushing. I've been at the Shawnee County Fair years ago. There were some airbrush artists out there doing t-shirts. And it just fascinated me how fast they could accomplish, go from A to Z, and have something done at no time at all. Well, you brought a couple of things with you today, and I don't believe those were probably quick airplane um, jobs. Really, they, they were faster than you would think. I would probably have more time in prep time and clear coating to uh, get the mirror finished. Uh, this tank here, I probably got maybe eight hours of time in it. Uh, this tank here is probably closer to five. And um, they're tanks from a... Uh, they, these come, this is custom chopper tank. This is off of a uh, Harley Davidson 883. Um, it took me five years before I was comfortable to charge somebody. And I started out painting t-shirts, went into doing uh, racing helmets to learn how to paint on a round surface. And people that were seeing my helmets that I was painting, they jumped in there and said, hey, have you ever painted a bike? And I was like, e well, not yet. Well, you are a artist at La Comunidad, our new exhibit that's opening on September 3rd. And you will be a featured artist on September 18th during the Low Rider Car Show out at the library's East Parking Lot. And you said you're going to do a demonstration. What can we expect to see then? Um, I'm probably going to put together a sugar skull painting with uh, roses. and It'll take me about an hour to complete it. Wonderful. So we're not going to paint kids? No. <laughs> well, Jeff, thank you. And I'm sure that Everyone will look forward to seeing your demonstration on Saturday, September 18th from yes. 11 to 1 p.m. at the Topeka and Shawnee County Public Libraries. Yeah, and